I can tell you that in the time I've been here, there's nothing that I have looked forward to more than uh, trying the famous Ipswich clams here at Bigelow's, which since 1939 has been this uh, fixture in uh, Rockville Center. Most of us, when we uh, have fried clams, the rest of the country, at least where I was born, we sort of, uh, we think of fried clams in terms of strips, but there's another kind. The Ipswich clam, which comes from Massachusetts, the marshlands, the mud flats there, and it's a soft shell clam, uh, and the whole belly is allegedly delicious. I don't know, I haven't tried it yet. It's tender, it has a little bit of a briny flavor, almost like oysters. In 1935, Russ Bigelow worked at the clam box in Ipswich. So he moves to Long Island, but before he goes, he says, I want the purveyors to ship those clams down to Long Island. Basically, you would gas up, get your clams, and go to the beach. One thing I forgot to ask you about, you guys make your own condiments and stuff. Yeah. In 1991, the Andreolis family bought this place, and everything went around, along swimmingly until about March of this year. Ever since, you know, COVID and everything that happened, it's been, you know, a lot more of a struggle to keep the business running. Although, people made it their business to get their clams anyway. I heard that people were bringing their lawn chairs and they were like yeah. getting a takeout and sitting in the optical shop's parking lot, right? Exactly, they were sitting <laughs> all over. Other people would put post-it notes on their window of their order. They pop the trunk, <laughs> the money is in an envelope, and uh, you know, they'll take the money, place the close the trunk, and they're on their way. And a few months ago, Chris and his brothers had the idea to build this outdoor area. It's cute. It's like a, you know, Huckleberry Finn meets Pleasantville kind of a thing. A little something extra for you to try. <laughs> so these are the Damn. strip clams here. I feel like I've died and gone to heaven. <laughs> this is amazing. All right. Strips, whole belly. The uh, strips here are the ones from the Atlantic Surf clam. It's a hard shell clam, which are cut into strips because you can't eat them otherwise. They're too tough, but they do have a sweetness about them, which is quite uh, appealing. Usually when you have these, it's like eating a breaded and fried plate of rubber bands. I came here for the whole belly clams, but I stayed for the strip clam. How? What are bigger sellers, strips or bellies? You sell a lot of both. <laughs> You're being diplomatic. I mean, the food's delicious here. It's terrific, but to me, what really stands out is the fact that uh, this is a tenacious family that never gives up. We were always brought up to work hard and do whatever it took to get the job done. But not only just to get the job done, but to get it done right. Mm -hmm. And um, that was the main, our main goal, you know, as a family. And we stuck together through all this. And you know, success will come as long as you're doing, you know, something that's passionate to you. And uh, that has brought their business back to where it was, almost to where it was before. That is good. Wow, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for bellies. I've decided, but I'm gonna eat both actually. <laughs>